What's going on, everybody? It's Donna G Buckets here. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we're about to get into this Trey Young build video. And in my opinion, in my opinion, this is the best point guard build on the game. Like, it, it's, it's, it's not even close. Hold on. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get into this. All right, so the pie chart you're going to be using is the playmaking and shooting one, obviously. <laughs> what else? Would it... All right, so you're going to pick this pie chart, the one that has the most uh, vertical and most agility. All right. All right, so you're going to be putting up your main categories first, the shooting and the playmaking. Then you're going to go down to your uh, defense, put up your perimeter defense, your lateral quickness, and your steal. You're going to go back up here, put up your driving layup, close shot, and dunk. And you got eight, eight uh, points left. You can put it towards interior defense just in case someone gets past you. You can put it towards block or anything. I'm going to put it towards interior defense. All right. Trey Young isn't that big. Um, see, this is the part where Trey Young is 6'1. He's pretty small. But on this game, if you're lower than 6'3, you're not going to be good. So you can either go 6'3 or you can go 6'4. Your three pointer will be the same, but your mid range will go down if you're 6'4 or go down one point. Um, and your speed and acceleration will go down. But if you decrease your, acceler uh, your, your weight, your acceleration and vertical will go back up to where it was. You decrease your wingspan all the way, and look, your three-pointer goes up to an 88. Slap a boost on it. Simple. The only thing is a ball handle. If you're 6'3", your ball handle will be a 91 instead of an 89. But, I mean, it's not really a big of a difference because you still get the same dribble move. But, uh, yeah, so decrease the uh, wingspan, and you're going to go with a sharp, uh, the sharp shooting takeover because you're, you're a shooter. Why would you go playmaking? Dame and Trey Young. Offensive threat. All right, so we're going to go to test build. See the badges. That's what we're looking for. All right, so for the first badge, or for the uh, finishing badges, you only have four. So what you can do, you can just put a contact finisher for contact layups and then consistent, just so you make your layups and stuff. Put those, both of those are silver. Or you could put on, like, like, silver contact finisher, silver fancy footwork. Or you can even go fancy footwork and slither finisher. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go contact finisher, silver, and fancy footwork on silver. Shooting. You need to go to catch and shoot Hall of Fame, of course. Put difficult shots on silver for now. We're gonna fix that later. Uh dead eye silver, range extenders on Hall of Fame. Um you can put on green machine silver for now. Quick draw is on gold or either silver, whichever one you want. Um you could do slippery. Nah, don't do that. <laughs> don't, don't do that. Don't do slippery out ball. Hot zone hunter on silver. Flexible relief. I don't, like. Honestly, who's mistiming a jump shot that bad? If you're mistiming your jump shot like super bad, like, shouldn't be a shooter anyway. Um. Yeah, so from here, you can just use these last three to put up other stuff like gold difficult shots, gold green machine, gold hot zone hunter. Or you can put these towards uh, corner specialist or volume shooter or something, but I, I would suggest these. All right, so for the playmaking, uh, you can put ankle breaker at silver. This badge doesn't really work anyway. <laughs> it's needle threader. Gonna need dimer. Trey Young is a he's second in the NBA right now in assists. So, all right, quick first step. He's a pretty quick player too. Silver handle for day handle for days. Um, gold unpluckable. Gold stop and go and gold tight handles. And then the last one you can put on like Lob City Passer or you can put on uh, Space Creator. I, I probably put on Space Creator because the lobs are broken on this game anyway. You could take Ankle Breaker down too and put it on like put a bat, Needle Threader on gold or either Handle for Days on gold or either one of these four on uh, Hall of Fame. But I guess I'll just leave on Ankle Breaker for now. Defense, uh, you can either put Clamps or Pick Dodger. Uh, you're a point guard, so you're probably going to be getting hit by a lot of screens, so I just put on a pick dodger. All right, and that's going to do it for this build video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. This is Donna G Buckets, and until the next video, I'm out. I think I'm falling for you.